Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. I am Docs, and this is Divinity Original Sin, where two ladies go adventuring. As you can see here, we have Chloe on the left and Scarlet on the right. So our little Shadow Blade and Battle Mage are going to see if they can find a sorcerer and put an end to the threat on Sycio. So far, they have uh, run into a summoner. A dungeon full of traps and skeletons, and now an orc raiding party, which gave us a bit of trouble. But now we have uh, the pleasure of leveling them up to level 2. In between episodes, I went back to that uh, first cave, and if you watched that episode, you know that I missed a key, which was actually pretty obvious because it was right next to the chest. So I got uh, I got that one and I received the um, no not this one this one I got uh, this poison arrow uh, uh, scroll so now we are ready to go forth and upgrade our uh, cute little heroes so Chloe over here is a shadow blade so for Shadow Blades, it seems that intelligence and speed and dexterity are the main, uh, the main uh, abilities. So, not sure which one to improve now. I will actually improve dexterity. Mm, okay, or not dexterity. Or... Uh, Okay, now I'm lost. Dexterity based weapons. Okay, let's improve dexterity. Yep. That is fine. So now we have dexterity, intelligence and speed at 7, while the other ones are at 5. Yeah, these guys are a little uh, moody over here. So let us find a different spot where people are a little bit more cheerful. So we don't... Uh, Going to the depression by with all the negative thoughts around here. Oh, and the shell. It's like, oh, and the dead orc. What's this ingredient? Yes, that guy is pretty upset. Okay, so upgrading ability. So we have one available ability upgrade point, which we are going to use on. Not on this one, because I cannot. What do I need for a level? I don't know. So our uh, uh, Shadow Blade so has a single-handed level 1. Okay. Defense. No, I don't really want anything for defense at the moment skill so she's an arrow surge surge or whatever that's pronounced I'm not an expert marksman geomancer what does the geomancer do earth spells hydrosophist this is water spells i guess man at arms I don't want, I already have one man at arms, and that's the battle mage. Scoundrel, okay, but. Lucky charm. Leadership. Charisma. Bartering. Okay, so a shadow blade, what should have? What should. How do you see a shadow blade being? Nasty deeds, what nasty deeds? Okay, so we have sneaking. Pocketing. Okay, I would like to get lock picking for this uh, for this one. Uh, we have scoundrel, witchcraft, and arrow third. I guess this is enough. I would like to get uh, a bow skill actually, or crossbow. Hmm, interesting. We'll decide this, that in uh, in the future when we level up again. Uh, I guess I will give charisma to her. 
and or maybe lucky charm extra treasure all treasure is always nice oh well yeah but uh, there's no point in finding treasure if you cannot lock pick it so lock picking it is yep now we are done with this one and let's assign something to her so she's got intelligence constitution speed and strength at six what well, she's got yeah i guess she's got the same thing but this is uh spread between constitution and speed the perception is low hmm okay so i want more strength so i can equip stronger items so I guess this is a simple choice. I want her to be a uh, more of a battle and less of a mage. So, yep, some something in the in the ways of a magic initiated knight, to say so. And let's see. Okay, no, what skills do we give this one? So, okay, she has single-handed defense. She has. Armor specialist. Yep, that is good. Should I get her shield specialist so I use her as a tank? Or what other skill? Okay, man at arms, pyrokinetic, and witchcraft. Yep, that is okay. I think this is enough at the moment. Uh, these ones will come later on. So let's see, blacksmithing allows you to repair your own items. The more you invest, the faster you'll work. Required to create and improve metal enhanced weapons and armor. Crafting. Crafting determines what you can craft and the quality of your crafted items. The more you, the more invested it is, the faster you can craft. Lore masters. This is for the identification purposes. And telekinesis. Ah oh, man, so this is used to open doors that have their uh, locks on the other side. That's nice to have. Okay, but I will go with blacksmithing because I cannot allow myself to have my items die on me in the middle of a fight. So yeah, I have, I have fighting for fights. I have enough skills. Yep. So it will be a skill like blacksmithing that's it and we are done wow this level playing up stuff is pretty cruel in this uh, in this game there's so much to choose from and so little skill points oh, man. okay so wow already that much time passed from this episode okay let's go forth and get a little bit more of the story out of the way let's say first because I'm not sure I would I will choose the same abilities and uh, attributes the next time if I die. Okay, are who? What's all this ruckus? Sounded worse than a dozen tomcats fighting over the world's last mecker. <laughs> ah, but I see we suffered another orc landing, and by judging by the relative ease with which it was dispatched, I can only come to one conclusion: source hunters have arrived in Sicil. Yeah, yeah. We're here. You're as welcome as a glass of cooled milk on a hot day, my friend. I'm Arhu, at your service. It was I who requested your presence here in this troubled city. You see, I'm sure Source is tangled into the murder of Councillor Jake, but Captain Aureus, commander of the Legion in Sicil, insists I'm seeing ghosts. I insist he's blind to all but the undead. Why are you convinced sorcery was used? It's hard to put my finger on it, but I can feel my very whiskers. What? Whiskers? <laughs> that foul magic was at play. Visit the scene of the crime and I'll bet sardines for salad. <laughs> You'll say the same. You can find it in King Crab Inn, by the way. The scene of the crime, I mean. The Legion has it under guard. The orcs were dispatched. They were led by a human. A human, you say? Truly? But that would be like a kitten leading a wolf pack. And yet, I have heard rumors about a sect of sorts, a shadowy set of worshippers that associate even with orcs. Some say they, they're 
sorcerers, but people will say that about anyone who behaves a bit strangely nowadays. I don't quite... I don't know quite what to make of this news, but thank you for informing me. It would be wise not to dismiss such a curious event out of hand. What exactly is the trouble you're having with the undead? Ah, the undead. Well, they're Cyseal's main threat, aren't they? They've been clawing their way out of the ground for two years now, and for two years the stalemate between them and the living has been dragging out at a weary pace indeed. The Legion did a good job keeping them at bay, but I think it's fair to say that without my magic-infused balliste, they'd have gotten the better of us by now. Someone is responsible for the outbreak, Necromancer are, necromancers are at work, but who are they and where do they hide? Alas, searching for them is like searching for a single louse in a lion's mane. Okay, so not the first time having trouble with orcs. Unfortunately, that is absolutely correct. The orc stitch is yet another hairball stuck in the city's already choking throat, and it shows no sign of abating. What's with this guy and the cats? Come on. We've cordoned off the western beach where most orc activity has been reported. For the nine lives of me, I can't seem to figure out what they're doing here. He doesn't look like a cat, do? does he? No. There's nothing of interest along the waterfront except for a set of caves with an unfavorable reputation. Maybe they're after some fictitious pirate treasure, the fools. Ha! I'm glad we've met Source Hunter and I'm certain we have a lot more to talk about. Feel free to visit me whenever you want. I've set up a workshop in the Legion's headquarters. Once you're there, just take the stairs, but do pay a visit to Aureus first. He may bark like a beagle with its tail stuck in the door, but you won't get very far in your investigation without speaking to the de facto leader of Cyseal. I wish you luck, Hunter. May your enemies prove to be mere mice and you the dauntless mouser. No, oh, boy. Sects, undead orcs. Looks like we have our work cut out for us. Okay. So, journal. Okay. Aureus, a son's harder journey, day one. Whoa. So much information. Oh, so this guy was a wizard. Awesome. Okay. Recipes, no. Map. What? So, this is Arhu and this is Aureus. Wow. They're. A... Oh man, these guys are pissing me off. What are. What's the deal with them and the orc lady? Come on. Let's go check it out. How do I get there? What are you doing here, orc lady? What? What are you doing here? Kill them and make them shut up. Okay, they're too far away. Yep. So let us save and avoid another long discussion. And now let's... Okay, so everything here is empty. And I remember someone was yelling in the previous episode that ships were ablaze. Okay. Okay, ships are ablaze. What do we do? Can I talk to anyone over here? Or should I just drop a rain? Okay, let's let's drop a rain scroll on this guy. Can I do this? Okay, yep, it seems it worked. I love this game. But now I'm out of rain scrolls. Figures. Okay, and do they get wet when it rains? Yes, they do. Can I? They actually do get wet. This is pretty cool. This is... Huh? Okay, let's see what... Can we get some fish? Yes, we got fish. Can we open... Can't reach. Okay, what can I do to reach this? Can I attack? 
I wouldn't let an orc be 500 yards in my loving nature. Okay. No, I don't wanna hit Chloe. I wanna hit this. Okay. I guess that will be reached some other way. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Okay, what's the burning ship about? Okay, so the orc shaman. Okay, let's see about the... Okay, so the wife did it. Yep, I can't tell about stuff like that. The wives always do it. Obviously. Medieval times, women, witches. Sure, let's have a go at them. So, okay, so gossips. Okay, yeah, I don't want to see what, what can you barter with me? Mortar and pestle. Do I need it? Healing potion. Man, that is expensive. I don't want to pay that much for it. Rope, mortar and pestle. Do I want... I think I want one actually. But unfortunately I don't have the skill to use it. Should I buy it just to have it? Hmm. Good question. Very good question. Hmm. I don't know. I don't really know. I'll take my leave. Let's see what's going on over here. Passing a love note to the lizard counselor's wife. <laughs> Is that why we never sail to Youthful Gore anymore? <laughs> okay, what's this? Youthful Gore. That loopy legionnaire really thinks that orky charmed. Okay, so we can take all this. Uh, oh man, so many people talking at once in this harbor. What? Was that a book in here? And what do we have in that book? Okay, so book, book, book. What's that? Fun with, with fluids. Okay, so... I guess as soon as I am able to... As soon as I'm able to use a crafting, I can read that. And let's see what's on this ship. Conrad, sailor. Do we have any captains around? I don't want to talk oh, to Conrad to or the call. sailors. Passing a love note to the lizard counselor's wife. Is that why okay, let's go see what this guy is about. These guys are too weird over here. Okay, so the orc sunk the, their ship. Okay, so if I found find a job for these guys, that will be cool. Bye. Okay, so how do I want to play this game? Do I want to be a good guy or do I want to be a bad guy and mean and piss everyone off? I'm not sure. But maybe we'll figure it out in the next episode. I am Docs. This is Divinity Original Sin. And this these are our lovely heroes, Chloe and Scarlet. I wish you all an awesome day and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.